we think this is going to be Charles and Camilla, but where have I heard that before? <laughs> oh, from myself, 30 seconds ago. And there they are. Yeah. Yes. In the very chapel where their own mm -hmm. marriage was blessed mm -hmm. a few years back. And they, of course, were married in the guild hall in a civil ceremony mm -hmm. here in Windsor. Yeah, how would you describe that hat, Anna? Camilla's. As done, I completely missed it. <laughs> and here's the queen. Queen. Oh, the queen's arrived. Beautiful. So I believe the queen is wearing lime green by Stuart Parvin, is it, Anna? Lime green by Stuart Parvin, yes. And the dress is by Angela Kelly, who makes a lot of her hats and has also worked closely with the queen for many years. And it's in the same lime silk tweed. Is that one of her favorite colors? Absolutely. That, she yeah. always does this wonderful citrus color. I think citrine of any kind is the, a very big trend today. It is. Um, the, um, this is handmade lace crystals mm -hmm. and pearls. Um, you know, girls, yes. the Queen always says she wears bright colors. You know what? Why? She says, I have to be seen to be believed. <laughs> <laughs> and I love yeah, that lime green. Me. It's kind of a chartreuse, and they're bathed in sunlight. It looks like they have mm -hmm. the sunroof open in there. There's Prince Philip doing well Great at 96 see. years Great old. Great to see Amazing. them together. Yeah, he's majesty. actually 97 next uh, next month, so having had that hip operation, recovered very well, desperate to be there, very close to Prince Harry, mm -hmm. both of his grandparents very close to him because when he was at Eton down the road, he'd often come over and see them for afternoon tea. Her Majesty uh, looking fantastic for, for 92, 66 years on the throne since she assumed it in February 1952, making her the longest lived and the longest reigning British monarch. And another um, connection between Prince Philip and uh, Harry was that they've both seen action uh, in, in war, and that's brought them together, as, of course, has Prince Andrew when he was a helicopter pilot during the Falklands War. So who does that leave? I was just thinking <laughs> The that. bride the and the bridesmaids and page boys? Absolutely. That's right. This is what oh, we've all been waiting for. Oh, we can see little child waving there. Page here. Oh, there's some girls with some flowers oh. in their hair. This looks very promising. All right. Mm. We're about to have cuteness overload. <laughs> Bring on the kids. Oh, wow. Oh, is that Princess Charlotte? I'm, I'm making a prediction now that yeah. Princess Charlotte will steal this show. Oh, you think so? <laughs> I think so. I okay. Think she, she's happy with the crowd. We, I saw her at the Lindo Wing when little Prince Louis was born and she was happy to give everyone a wave. Very adept at that already, she showed. <laughs> oh, look, they're already waving. <laughs> they look, they're so excited. <laughs> this looks like it's their day, don't you think? Four minutes until the wedding is due to begin. I think once the queen enters, they don't uh, delay. No, no one dilly dally. No, no dilly dally. We have to commend their timekeeping. They're right on time at this stage. Everyone rises for Her Majesty when she comes in. Let's listen. And now we're starting to see those darling <laughs> <laughs> bridesmaids, page boys, and mummies, the nervous mummies holding hands and helping them 
to get there. The other stars of the show. So who are we seeing? Who are all these children? So the children are mm -hmm. Prince George and Princess Charlotte. Yes. And it looks like there's girl Where's power going Kate? on there. The Duchess of yeah. Cambridge with her. Uh, she's got two flower girls there. Then okay. we have Jessica Mulrooney, who is uh, Meghan's best friend, mm -hmm. with her twin boys and her daughter. We then also have, I'm trying to work out who the other lady is. Alice Van Cutsum. Alice yes. Van Cutsum there Mother with little Florence. Florence. Yeah. And have we also got Jake Warren's wife there? Jake Warren's wife is, is just Zane. there, there. Mm -hmm. Zoe, yeah. uh, just at the back. She's pregnant again, I think, and uh, some it's very okay. sweet little children. And again, we should point out that we are going to see this wedding dress long before Harry will. The Duchess of Cambridge, of course, mm -hmm. now inside. Uh, meaning just one person left. We're about to have our moment. And it's fair to say she's going to arrive right <laughs> on time as the clock is about to strike is... noon here in Windsor, England, where we will have a royal <laughs> wedding. Well, did she arrived at the chapel on time? It's down to the second. I am just shocked. On the button. 7 a.m. in the east. She was four seconds late. <laughs> <laughs> That's English timing for you, isn't it? <laughs> that are with Megan there. Uh-huh. She looks regal. She looks absolutely regal. It's Givenchy, Claire Waitel Waitkeller. I, is Wait, I say that correctly? All I know is I have a Santa, Santa Roberts Santa with a jaw drop. Again. We need to bring the medics. <laughs> <Santa Pascal. laughs> we have had so many different names bantered around about this dress. If this is Givenchy. Claire I. Keller is an incredible British designer who's recently started working for the House of Givenchy. And what that a beautiful train. Uh, wow, and that gorgeous. moment, you need that drama moment on those 22 steps that she's walking up. This train is absolutely stunning. The dress is very regal, very simple. The boat neck, the fit and flare shape, very, very regal. Regal, maybe Claire even Rachel. angelic with the way mm -hmm. how sheer that veil is. It's mm -hmm. very beautiful. Claire Wake Keller. Another Wake Keller. today fans thanks for checking out our YouTube channel subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews show highlights and digital exclusives